had yeah. one in the camp last night. Yeah. But it was hanging away. Okay. <laughs> um it was close to my room actually. Yes, yeah. yeah. So these are very good predators and scavengers. Okay, the hyenas in Kruger Park will scavenge more than 60% of the food that they consume because of the high amount of other predators like lions, cheetahs, leopards, uh, dogs, wild dogs. Um, so they will steal a lot of their food uh, from those predators. But in areas like in Botswana, the Kalahari, where there's not a lot of uh, other predators, not as high density, the hyenas will actually hunt more than about 60% of the food that they consume. So they're forced to hunt. They hunt in packs and they use endurance to tire down the prey. So they will uh, pursue and they, they use numbers. Now they've also got a very powerful bite. This animal has got the strongest jaws of any land mammal. They can uh, bite through bone. Um, they can bite through bone. They will uh, eat through giraffe or elephant bone. They do that so that they can get more calcium. Yeah. Okay. So you can often find a hyena dung when it's dried out. It is white in color. It looks like chalk. It's that calcified. Uh, it's a calcified dung. It's uh, got high levels of calcium in it, which makes it that white color. Now they've also got very strong stomach enzymes. They can break down anything except for hair. So when a hyena eats and it gets a lot of hair, okay, it'll bring that up. It'll okay. like it'll just like a cat does. It's got like a fur ball that comes up. Sometimes in that hair you can find claws and teeth. Okay, from uh, if it's eaten something like a uh, a leopard cub or a lion cub you can find pieces of that animal still in there beautiful creature and spotted hyena we've got a, there's a number of hyenas inside Africa. 